If I ain't get a lot of sacks, then they hold me. All right? All right? I've so, not heard that ever before. So if you no, look no, up no. and I ain't getting no sacks, they hold me. The guy can turn the corner about three inches off the ground. There aren't many guys who can do that. He gives you very little surface to hit. TJ Clemens played with the guy, a great player. Great, great kids, just TJ has no chance from jump. You know, the first step, he just, he literally went right around him. Wow, that jump he got was unbelievable. You ask left tackles around the league, he's probably the most difficult to block just because you don't know what you're gonna get. What? He'll spin. You overset him, he'll work inside. And who else but Von Miller? Von Miller, the 11th time he has sacked Phillip Rivers. He's a funny dude, man. You know, the jokester in the locker room, he's always dancing. When he did a sack, everybody's waiting to see what he's going to do. Another interesting dance. You know, the Key and Pill one that he did this year was pretty funny. Oh, we got something of a shooting gallery Oh, going yeah, on. look at that. Boy, that is something. That's my type of humor right there. I love Key and Peele. Like that. Find me. That can, can they find me for that? I'll leave it. I'll leave it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think he can dance. I just think it's funny that he tried to dance, and that's what makes it funnier to me. What is that? <laughs> Von Miller's impact during the playoffs was no joke. In the AFC Championship game, Miller and the Broncos hit Tom Brady a season high 20 times. Even when Miller did not rush, he still got the jump on Brady. He knows the type of coverage that we're going to be in. And it feels good to, you know, even up the score with a pick. Ha <laughs> ha, <Dumb. laughs> I love you, baby. You too, man. Let's go. Cut it loose. I'm happy you're my quarterback, man. I'm happy I missed you. Thank you, buddy. Yes, sir. Miller helped Peyton Manning win another Lombardi trophy thanks to his MVP performance in Super Bowl 50. That play in the Super Bowl was just insane. He practically took the ball out of Cam's hand. If Cam didn't have giant mutant hands, he's walking into the end zone. They rush four. In the pocket, he's good. He pops the ball, knocked down his hands. On that play, he just came around the edge of Remus. He was on me quick, but I was able to target my shoulder pads and get around him. And I remember thinking, like, man, you know, Cam got enough room to run, but he was still looking downfield. He had a deep seven that was wide open, so that's where his eyes was, and it held the ball enough for me to get around and just tap the ball, fill up. All right, so who's your number one player in the NFL? I just got to give it to him. Without him, I don't know if they win the Super Bowl. <laughs> Not to get a Super Bowl MVP, he should have got postseason MVP. Where do you see yourself on this list? I don't know. Now, if we had a, a top 100 of the greatest teammates, and I would have to be, you know, at least top five. There's been some times where I took Malik Jackson and put his dirty clothes in the bin. I never talked about it, but I did that for him, and that alone has put me top five.